Hello guys, uh, this is Hungry. I'm back again with a post-match reaction against Super Sports United. Uh, we were away on the day, which was last night, we were away against Super Sports United. The game finished as a draw, nil-nil. Uh, what are my thoughts on the game? Team selection, I really, I, I don't know why, I, I'm not sure if Lodge was dropped for the game or not. But uh, we saw we saw Pule start with Lamini um, as our our tens as our attacking midfields. Um, Evan Gao was up front in midfield. We had Tim and Musele, which I think is a good combination. They work well together. Tim doesn't like to run to run with the ball as much. He doesn't like to take so many turn, so many touches. And Musele is the opposite. He likes to drive with the ball, take many chances, take people on, and then release it in the final third. So I think that's a good combination. It works really well. We had Hoto on the left, and then we had Monyane on the right. Uh, our back three was Koki, Sibisi, and Da. Uh, nah, they were solid for me. Even though they didn't get tested much, I think they were solid. Uh, and Ofori as our goalkeeper and he was kept on in the night so first chance first and only chance i think we considered in the first half was when munyane tried to go past three super sport players and he got caught on position maseko i think got the ball was able to put it across our goal line and Hrobla failed to capitalize i uh, headed it wide and yeah, man, there's not really much to speak about in the first half. Um, even though I think I think Pule was bad on the day, he 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 didn't he wasn't on his A game. He couldn't control the ball as as clean as I'm used to him controlling it. He he couldn't pass as clean as I know him to be able to. And like he kept trying too much. He kept trying to to break the lines. And when when like sometimes you know when things are just not going well for you. You need to keep things simple. Do those one two passes. Um make the run. Just keep things simple. And we saw this. We saw him uh there was a there was a point where team pressured Rasi Buche from Super Sports. Uh, he, he was able to get the ball, dispossess the opposition, he was able to get the ball and he took one chance and so Bule gave him a perfect pass. Bule was just supposed to take that on his right and put it in his stride and get the goal because, excuse me, because we know Bule can finish. Uh, but he failed to control it, his first touch was bad and after like two, three chances, was able to control it then gave it to Hoto. Hoto hit the side netting and that's one thing I think Hoto did did like didn't do justice to the chance. He should have put that ball across the keeper. Um if you're gonna go for goal, go across to the far post. Don't go to the near post. Because if you go to the far post and the keeper uh fails to catch it or to save it, it's a goal if he fails to save it. But if he fails to like catch it it falls for us and someone else could be there to finish the chance off. Um, really not much to talk about in the, in the first half. I really enjoyed Tim's performance. I enjoyed Tim's performance throughout the game. Um, he, him and Musel, I think, are a very good combination. I'm not impressed with what Jose is doing. I don't see why he dropped Lodge. Did he drop him or is he still trying to find the right combination? For that attacking position those two who are taking because we know he's he's showing us that he's gonna stick to his system to his formation that he knows um the three four two one or the three four three depending on how high our our tens are or our because to me they are tens they're not really wingers because the wing the width is coming from our right wing back and our left wing back. And we've seen that throughout our games. Um, we, had, we had more control of the midfield, unlike the previous game. We had more control of the midfield. And 
game went to the second half, half time, nil nil. We obviously we know now that it finished nil nil, but it went to the second half, nil nil. And the first chance we got was when Super Sport tried to clear the ball. The ball, Hoto was able to hit it, um, and then Lamine flicked it. Musele was able to control it, gave it to Evanga. Evanga held it back. Musele really one one pass to Evanga's channel, and Evanga did what Hoto was supposed to do in the first half. Got it on target, got it on target on his left foot. Got it on target. Keeper made a save. Pule was supposed to slot that one in, but then Pule failed and it went over the bar. Um, that's what we need for our strikers. And, and luckily, we, we didn't create enough. We didn't create enough and we didn't create any clear-cut chances. It's hard to judge our strikers when there are no clear-cut chances in a game. Uh, I, I don't want to put pressure on our strikers, but we need to get them firing. We need to... We need to see what was working at Chipa when, or like, how did you, how, why was he able to get those 10 goals? That might be a different video, but right now, yeah, we, we talk about the match against Super Sport. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share this video. Um, second half, yeah, we had that chance. And then there was also the Lamini chance where Hoto, Hoto ran. Uh, there was a one-two, he ran past the defender and then cut it back for Lamini. Lamini then hit it off, like, hit it off target with his right when I think he could have taken a touch. When you take a touch, the ball is under your control. Even though you're hitting it with your weaker right, you can still be able to get on target. He tried to hit it first time, got it off target and that's a chance that went up big. Um, in, a, in another instance, if, if a better player or a better finisher is in that position, that's a goal-scoring chance. Even though there are defenders in front of you, one or two defenders, you are able to get that on target and it's a goal because it was, it was in the 18-yard area and it could have been a good chance if someone else thought differently in that situation. Um, there's really nothing much to say about the game. From my end, I, I wasn't very impressed with our performance. I think Supersport um, had a low block and that's how we were allowed to have so much control of the game. Uh, we, we saw, like I said, our defense was solid, but we saw CBC fail to control another ball or head out another ball that was coming in the air. Instead of letting it bounce you need to hit those balls first time hit it out then the danger's gone but he failed to hit it out and then he got muscled off the ball yeah he got muscled off the ball fell the ball fell to Reynes. Reynes didn't get it on target and the game finished nil nil another chance that could have killed us was the chance that fell to that fell to Kabuza. Uh, Ofori, I think Ofori just has a mistake in him in every game now. We need to expect that he's gonna do something bad. He's he's not gonna have a hundred percent game. Whether we are under threat or not, Ofori is gonna have a mistake in him. I'm starting to accept that, and I think everyone else needs needs to do that because he should have stood his ground, but he decided to leave his line go to the person who has the ball and then they were able to cross that ball in posts had no one there we were lucky that the chance fell to Gabuza Gabuza instead of just side footing it into the net I don't know what it does like I don't know he's been doing that for years now he's so bad so bad he's so bad I don't even want to talk about him but anyway we were lucky that that chance fell to him uh, Ofori needs to do better, especially when you're the captain. We need to have confidence in you. And we need to have confidence in Jose Luis. Because right now he's making life or life changes. He's not changing things tactically. And that could, that could be something that um, is, 
is to our detriment in the future because yes the season is long and it's we know it's not a sprint it's a marathon so but right now super sport was bottom of the league you were supposed to punish get the three points and keep on moving we we need to change something when the momentum is not with us the the manager needs to see that and change something tactically that would bring the momentum to our side but right now it just makes like for like changes um, I was impressed with Makaringe coming on and as soon as Obviously as soon as Lodge came on we saw Pule's game become better. Like I said, they have that tele Telepathic connection to each other. They know which who's gonna be where at what time like they play well together and You don't need to try so many combinations Jose, you don't need to try so many combinations. Pule and Lodge work together. Just fix here and there, make some a few tweaks. And yeah, Lipasa came on also. I think we need to start giving him minutes because Evan God didn't pull trees with his performance. Pepra hasn't done that also. Let's give Lipasa a chance and see what happens. So yeah, um, we're obviously waiting for Mahupo to come back. Uh, there's really not much to say about the game. We got the draw, and it is what it is. Not recording. Fuck. So yeah, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Have your say in the comments below. Tell me what you think about the game. Tell me who was your man of the match. My man of the match was Miguel Tim. Tell me who was your man of the match. And we got the draw. We are third on the table. We'll see what happens. Bye.